Let's edit your customizable template using a free Canva account. While logged into Etsy, go to your account and hit Purchases. A list will come up of your recent purchases. We're going to select on the Pokemon Invitation Download. And we're going to come across to the button that says Download Files and click it. And you'll be prompted one more time to select the Download button. Go ahead and click that and it'll open up this PDF file for you here. What you will see is several options to edit your invitation, your thank you tag, your template. We're going to click on to edit the template and come down to the use template button. The template will automatically open and the content is ready to edit. To customize the words, such as the name, address, and age, we're just going to double click on them and then begin typing the correct information. You can also change the font style, color, and size. Here you can see we can go and choose a new font. Not all of these will be available in your Canva. These, some of these I have specifically on mine. But you can come over here and also change the effects as well add backgrounds, neon, make shadows, but of course the font that goes with it is the one that works best. You can come up here if you make a mistake or you want to start over and hit that little back button to go back. We are just going to keep editing our design here, playing around with some of the elements. You can move them around to see where you'd like them. You can change the size of your font here, larger and smaller, and remember that back arrow button. If you make a mistake, you can always go and hit it and go back to the original document if you hit it enough times. You can change your address, the time, the date, the age, the name, and then when you're ready to download, come up to the share button. You're going to select download. You can select a PNG. You can also select the PDF print file if you're going to be printing this and select the format you would like and hit download. This should just take a moment. Um, it's usually pretty quick. And then once it's downloaded, go ahead and save it where you'd like. I like to save to my desktop. That way I can easily find it and send it to where I need to and close it down. You can come back to the original PDF you downloaded and see the links on here. You can visit my shop by clicking this link here and contact me with any questions. And then you can also edit your tag, your invitation, and your phone template if they came with your item. You'll just click on each of those and go to edit the template it brings up. The thank you tag is really quick. Just edit your information on there. You can also change it to add more text if you would like. And then the phone template is very similar to the invitation. It'll have more detailed information as well. You will want to save this as a PNG file versus the PDF that we saved the invitation as. This makes it easier to do an airdrop or email to your phone. That way you can send it out as a text message to invite your guest as well versus saving it as a PDF like we did with the invitation. Again, you can do all this with the free version of Canva. You don't need to purchase any other versions. Everything here is included that you see. If you are playing around in Canva, there are other settings that have a little crown next to them. Those are the pro things that you would need to use those items. However, you can download everything you need for your template using the free version of Canva. And we're just going to finish up editing our birthday template here for the phone. Remember the back button, super easy to use. If you make a mistake, you can come and hit this to go back as many times as you need to. Hit it enough times, it takes you back to the original. If you are just editing your name and information, you don't need to change the font, you don't need to change the size. Everything will be perfect the way it is, so you can just put in your information and download it. The extras are kind of there if you just want to play around with them. Again, you will have to have a Canva account, so if this is your first time using Canva, you will, you will need to sign up for the free account. However, you do not have to purchase the Pro version to use the features that are on your template. If you have any questions editing your template, feel free to reach out to me. If you decide 
editing the template is just not for you and you would like me to do it for you, please reach out. We can definitely do that and have that available for you and send you the download already done with your information. Thanks for watching. I hope this was easy and I hope you enjoy your product.